previously on Fire Emblem Three Houses. Is this it? Is this the one you were looking for? Oh, you cut one. Yes! Yeah! Here you go, Flake! Yeah! Just toss the fish on her, just like start flapping on her. Oh, God, yeah! I'm so happy right now! Oh, go, Magic Heart, make Flane happy. Yeah! And now back to Garrick Mach Minus. Uh, Fessinico? Uh, yes, Kuzuru? I got a question. Lately, I feel like I'm failing my tile of ultimate Yakuza. Fessa, what can I do to help step up my game? Honestly, that's a bit outside my field of expertise. But it's all right. I do know someone who can help. Principal Karyu. <laughs> you call Professor. One of our students needs your expertise. And also, you know you can open that door, right? Principal Karyu, what can I do to be the best Yakuza ever? All right, I'm going to walk you through our five-step program, all right? Try to keep up. The first thing I'm going to need is a volunteer. Uh, I'm pretty sure uh, Larry wants to volunteer. What? Yeah, Larry, get over here. Oh, God. Now, Kuzuru, the first thing that any good Yakuza needs to know is the proper way to curb stomp. Now, Larry, I need you to lie on the ground and pretend I just beat you up. You want me to do what? Now, nah, screw this is taking too long. Oh, my God. Now, the key to Kuzuru is to make sure to crush his head in, but without actually killing him. Is that actually possible? It is when you do it the Kiryu way. Watch this. Oh, my God. All right, now you try. All right, here I go. Ha! Ah, you're a natural. Keep doing it. Yeah, all right. Now let's do it together. Hello! B. Back with some more Fire Emblem Three Houses. When we last left off, we participated in a fishing tournament, which resulted in us finding the biggest fish in the pond to give to Flane. But not the biggest, biggest fish. No, she didn't want that one. She wanted just the biggest fish. Because Flane is a little picky penguin. Is that right, Flane? I don't know what you said, but yes, probably. <laughs> <laughs> but actually, in regards to that fishing tournament, you guys actually shared an interesting bit of uh, info that I sort of missed out on. And uh, that info was revealed by uh, JV, who last episode said, Oh, man, you didn't talk to Flane before accepting the tournament. She says how she told Seta she was craving a particular fish, but she forgot what kind. How does he answer this? He holds a full fishing tournament so that someone may hopefully catch the one she wanted. Instead of that here being brother of the year. Oh my God, that is, oh my God, that is so funny. That is so funny. <laughs> so he's like, I feel like having a fish. <laughs> fishing tournament. <laughs> Everybody comes out all for a fishing tournament for Flame. That's literally the only reason we're doing this. Oh my God, that is so funny. Man, Seth really loves his little sister. <laughs> Maybe a little too much, but nah, I mean, it's, it's cute. It's especially cute just because, you know, he he almost lost her, right? So now he's just like in super hyper protective big brother mode. I'm going to do whatever it takes to make sure you stay satisfied and happy. Ah, uh, <laughs> JV, thank you so much for sharing that with me. I am, I that just made this, 8 billion times cuter than it already was. And it's for that reason you are comment today. Okay, guys, guys. There's something though. I, I have a massive request for you guys, right? This is this is Panda Maho levels of requests here, okay? I actually asked in the comments last episode, is this a meme? This uh flame fish thing? Turns out it, it it is. It is a bit of a meme already in the in the fandom. But in my opinion, I don't think it's enough of a meme. I think we need to go further beyond. So can I please start seeing some more funny flame fish pictures? All right. Like her hugging on a fish or biting it or eating it or something. Just like just funny goofy shit. Nothing kinky, all right? I don't want I don't want you like guys to have any weird fish fucking or something going on, all right? Just funny goofy shit with flame and her weird love for fish. It's, I think it's the funniest shit ever, and I want to see more of it, and I want to see more memes of it. I know we've got some amazing Piggy Penguin R's out there. I just, I want to see some flame fish loving, or goblin a fish, or battling with one of the cats here, or with Morgana for some epic fish. I don't know. <laughs> There's so much potential. There's so much meme potential here. And I feel like wherever that meme is at right now is just not enough. So Piggy Penguins, I ask, no, I beg of you, please help make the flame fish me even more meme and more hilarious. This has been another loving request from your old pal, Nico Bizzle, the Donna Sizzle. Oh, and obviously nothing, nothing spoilery, which by the way, on that same line of, uh, of thought, apparently there were quite a few, uh, uh, spoilery comments last episode. The mods really had <laughs> their work cut out for them last time. And I, I just sort of want to remind you guys, I understand you're enjoying the Let's Play and maybe you just want to help, but uh, please do your best to refrain from, uh, oh God, change, change the night time. Please refrain from posting spoilery comments. Um, tips are fine, you know, and give, if you have some like small bit of advice for something, but don't like, don't tell me where like a story or a character is going to go or the secrets behind them or something. I know I ask questions and stuff sometimes when I'm like, like, what does this mean? But for story stuff, I'm not really asking you to tell me. I I'm going to figure it out myself. Unless it's something that's already been explained and I don't un already understand it, then d don't tell me. You guys have actually been pretty good for the most of this Let's Play, but uh, this last video was was uh, was pretty rough. So uh, please refrain from posting any big uh, character or uh, or main plot spoilers. Not just for me, but also for the people who also might be uh, 
playing through this blind. That said, if you do actually want to talk about spoilers and, and things from the main plot or things that haven't happened yet, we do have a Discord, an official Picky Penguin Discord. We're even Discord partners. We got a bunch of goofy emotes and crazy shit that you can use on our server and outside of it. There's a link to it in the video description. It's there in every single video. Please feel free to join. Come say hello. I also pop in every now and then to post my own dumb memes. But we have places there that lets you uh, talk about uh, all these different Let's Plays. And you go there and talk as much about the plot as you want. But what you guys explained to me, apparently the thing with uh, Juritza was that he... It basically served as a uh, a weapon instructor at the academy and it seemed uh likely or at least a possibility that he was also recruited pretty early on like i was myself so he hasn't actually been here that long i see okay well it's something i guess it always just seemed like he was just kind of there and it was unusual to, not to see him as like a uh, a member of the Knights of Saros, like everybody else, you know? But I appreciate the explanation. Oh, yes, you guys also informed me. So apparently Gilbert actually cannot be recruited for a good while. So um, I might want to try to uh, focus on, in the meantime, maybe just eating with him and getting him uh, to level up a bit more with uh, what his affinity with both Annette and Demetrius. Those are the big ones and the ones I really want to see. So, okay. All right. That's that's a bummer. Maybe it's that way for the, the remainder. Like, Alois is the same way or something. I also just see a lot of tips from people who are saying, you know, Nico, you should uh, recruit these characters because they unlock these further paralogs and also because they uh, delve further into their story and yada, yada, yada. And uh, I, guys, I think I'm, this is probably going to be it. I think the... the Once I got Raphael... Um, and also Marianne, who is is uh, ready now to uh, be recruited. Um, I I think that's probably uh, everybody I'm gonna, going to get at this point. And it's not that I don't want to see everybody else's, but like I'm I'm still considering playing through this game again and uh, doing one of the other routes um, and possibly seeing all the routes, you know. And if I do decide to do that, I know I would really regret trying to go through and see everybody in the first route because then it would really it, w it wouldn't make you feel like I a reason to go back through and do it again, you know? It would make a lot of the game feel the same. I mean, I've heard people who could go through and recruit everybody from all the houses. And that just, uh, that would, I think, be a bit overkill for me. So, I want to try to split things apart, you know? Not just be like, oh yeah, the only, pe only new character and story development I get is from the, the house leaders, you know? So, I might not get all the paralogs or all the, the bonus stuff for... Uh, people outside of my house but uh, I think that's good I think that will uh, help split things apart um, if I decide to play through the game again I don't even know how long this first you know playthrough of the game is going to take you know I, I don't know how many episodes it's going to be or how I'm going to feel by the end so but I think doing something preemptive like this is the best way to make sure that if I do decide to play down another route uh, I don't get burned out you know and we're constantly learning new stuff and each playthrough feels different at least that's my feeling about it. So hopefully you understand. I really don't think I need any more people. I mean, I've already, I'm already going to have a hard ass time figuring out who to add to fights with the lineup I have. That said, you guys did uh, uh, sort of suggest that maybe I don't always stick with just the blue lines for all my fights. Um, some of you thought, well, maybe you can mix them up and add people that were from, you know, that you have recruited that uh, may not necessarily use all the time. And that's a possibility, you know, and I know that some of these paralogs are going to require uh, specific party members from my own group here, right? And if they're too weak, then it might be a problem for one of those fights. I, I don't know. But maybe, like, if I end up getting characters that are just, like, super overleveled, like, like I do have a few people in my roster who are kind of kind of diesel by this point. Like, the dude's pretty fucking high right now. Um, as was myself. Honestly, so is Dimitri. So even though Dimitri wasn't in that last fight, he was, uh, I mean, he's kind of a beast right now. I'm trying to keep everybody around the same, but it's like, Surprisingly difficult to do. I don't know. We'll see. Oh, and you guys also uh, told me apparently Dimitri, he's not only a popular Fire Emblem char character, but also a incredibly popular Nintendo character in general. In fact, he was in the top 10 best Nintendo characters. Like he won like number eight in that poll from people. Holy shit. If that doesn't show the amount of fucking Dimitri Lovin in this world, I don't know what does. I must say, everybody has good taste because he is kind of amazing. Why do you think I'm so fucking infatuated with him? And I'm so pissed that I can't fucking do anything. All these feelings I can't do anything with. What am I supposed to do? Get one of these weirdos? Like this chick? With the weird tattoo thing? No. No. My eyes are only for Dimitri. And may that weird fish go all over there, but mostly Dimitri. All right. So I think we finished everything for today. Unfortunately, this time, because I do have 
um, classes uh, this these next few weeks. Uh, I don't think I'll be able to do the save scumming thing I was I did before with Bernadette because the the benefit of that was that I didn't actually have classes the following week. So basically, every time I I would reload it, I would just skip right through the week and basically get to see immediately whether I managed to recruit her or not. But if I do it this time, because I can't save on classroom days, if I happen to not get recruit the person uh, that week, that means I'd have to load it up and I have to redo the class day every single time. And I know there's like an auto instruct thing, but I really do want to have full control over what my uh, my party studies, you know? I, I don't know what the fucking computer's gonna do, so I'll trust it. So, all right, let's go ahead and end it for today. That's why the time actually goes by based on, it does seem to be not just actions you do, but actual, actual time. <sighs> all right. Now I can teach six people in total, which is nice. I think I want to keep Dimitri and Catherine together. I'm really curious to see that, uh, the interaction between them. So I think everyone's motivation is like, yeah. Everyone's motivation except for Ash is maxed out. So uh, I've got a lot of choices here. All right, Dimitri. You are just about to uh, put that horse there. Booyah. Each new experience is an asset. Hell yeah. All right. And authority. This will be useful. This will be. Oh, damn it. Almost. Uh, damn. Dude, dude, almost up to. Almost up to B plus already on axes. Jesus Christ, man. Okay, Sylvain, you are just about there with your spears. Hey, that was. Hey. Yes. I thought this was a test. Booyah. Sword breaker. I'm really getting the hang of this. You are. Good boy, Sylvain. Right, you have a cookie. Uh, all right. That's B. Should we go with horses here? Maybe I should work on his reason. It's like ah. Oh, it's like so hard because there just aren't like other than the end classes, there aren't really a lot of in between classes that actually make use of the reason skill with the spear and the horse. Authority might be good though, because well, authority is good for anybody just for being able to use uh, uh, your gambits. Um, eh, let's just keep going with horses. Wow, horsepower! Uh, oh, Annette, you are super close on uh, your faith. Recover, nice. Am I making progress? Absolutely, yes. Now you finally have that super uh, long range ability, uh, like Mercedes had. That guy, that, that that healing move is fucking amazing. Seriously, I don't have to be right next to them. I could be like super far away and still be able to heal them. That's just so good. So reason's already pretty high. I'm gonna start raising her, her uh, authority a bit more. So I think she can get some probably really good stuff for her rally. He did learn a lot. I think I'll probably end up using Casper in, uh, in this next fight in some way. So um, if I do, what do I want to actually do with him? Do I want to make him a Wyvern Rider or something? Or do I want to do, do something with like brawling? Well, I don't know. He could, I mean, he could easily be a war master. That's the thing with his ax and his brawl. That's kind of, it kind of seems like what he's made for. That's, that's what he's already high in. So there's actually in the advanced classes, there's the, there's the warrior and the grappler. The warrior is the versatile combat combatant, bo boasting high health and unmatched strength. The grappler is a master handing in combat. The grappler move, grappler mows down enemies with rapid blows. What is his speed like, though? Because the thing about like, for example, like to do, I don't think he'd make a great uh, brawler because he's just so slow. I mean, maybe if you got it early on and, and uh, like something fast early on and managed to get his speed up, then maybe. Okay, so he's got 11. How does it compare to other people? God, look how fast. Look how fast Felix is. 22 speed. That is insane. Oh, right. You guys told me the uh, the Levin sword. So what makes this one different is it's actually... So it says it's a magic weapon. What that means is it actually is based off your magic stat. Uh, meaning that uh, it's probably not going to go well with Felix. So I should probably not keep that on him. Actually, I'm not, in that case, I'm not really sure who I would give it to. Mercedes, you want to learn how to use a sword? I don't care if you're terrible at it. And you almost killed Dimitri in one of your supports. Man, Ingrid is fast as shit, too. Look at that. Her speed's 20 as well. Casper's okay. He's like kind of average. Maybe a little less than average, actually. All right, let's go ahead and teach him an axis then. I'll get it next time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nailed it. Nailed it. All right, C plus. Wild abandon. As long as it makes me strong. As long as it makes me do a god. 
Okay. That's leveled up. Now the question is, do I stick along that route? Or do I I guess it's it's a possibility. I mean I'm trying to think if I should make him like a like a, a wyvern rider or something. But he'd have to start from scratch here. And also I don't have any expertise on this, and he has no affinity to it. No, no, he's he's basically made to be a war master, so let's just keep going up with uh Thanks for your with this. Um, all right, two more people. I don't know about Flame's unusual. It's unusual that she she has such high spear and faith, and her strength is not that high. Like, I don't know, just weird. Like, I don't really see her going and kicking ass with a spear at all, with just that level of strength. So I don't know what class the game expects me to put her in. Her magic stat is just higher, so it seems like I should go with uh, with reason for her. I mean, she's got a a, a budding talent in it too. I was initially thinking Cyril might end up being a uh, a wyvern rider. And I think he could. Let's go with Flane, and we'll put some points into her her reason here. I would like to do this again sometime. I would like to do. There we go. All right, one more. All right, Cyril. I think I'm gonna I might actually use you next fight as well. Try to get you leveled up a bit. Um, so I'm gonna level up your flying. I feel like I've. Like I, this isn't so okay. I'll go with axes. I could have. Here we go. All right, productive day in the lesson. I have a question. What up, Felix? Magic is not my forte. Being gifted swordsman, I think my time is best served practicing sword play technique. Why should I waste my time attending lectures just to improve my magic skills from mediocre to average? No magic will make you a stronger swordsman. You should step outside your comfort zone. Stop complaining, go, go to class, yeah, that's it. Um, knowing magic will make you a stronger swordsman. You should step outside your, I think this. I see. Yeah, that's it. Boom, oh my God. You get, get that shit right, it gives you so much uh, professor experience. <laughs> if I have to hit someone, I want to do it from so far away. There's no way I can get it back. When I master the bow, then people everyone will know that that no be as Bernie the sniper. Uh, boating or bow riding? Uh, no, <laughs> no Bernie, no. You're you're born to be a bow knight, in my opinion. Oh fuck! Yes, yes! <laughs> By the power of RNG! Oh my god! Holy shit! That was lucky. That was fucking lucky. <laughs> Especially after last time, right? I had to save scum the game like like 12 times to get freaking Bernadette to show up. And Marianne dude does it the first fucking time. Thank you, God. Yes, Marianne. Um, professor, uh, I have a request. You come here, girl. It's about your class. I, uh... <laughs> Bye, no, I'm just kidding. Get in here. Uh, oh, thank you. We're gonna figure out why you're so sad, all right? And then we're gonna turn that frown upside doodly. Uh, I should be more comfortable speaking. I get to know you better. Yay! All right, cool. And actually, was she a healer? I don't even honestly remember. I think she was. Let's get to work, shall we? I guess someone's got to do it. Someone's got to do some shit. It is done. Oh, just good guys. Come on, you two. Just fuck already. All right. Ash, level B. Ooh, ooh. Each new experience is an asset. Ooh, defensive tactics. It's starting to make sense. Soul blade, sword prowess. Ooh, nice. I understand more every day. Yay! All right. So what she she's focused on sword and reason. That's interesting. I have to look at her skill set here. I thought I remember when I when she had her as an adjutant, her being like a priest or something. All right, pressure sure today is gonna be a battle day. Battle day, <laughs> and everybody else agrees. All right, what we got? Uh, oh God, yes. Demetri and Catherine. Okay, let's see what this entails. Hey there, at it again, are we? It feels like I see you training here every day. It's my daily routine. I'm ill at ease until I've held a weapon in my grasp. <laughs> you said the same thing when you were little. <laughs> right, you are. I've been meaning to come and talk to you properly for a while now. I was about to say the same thing. How long has it been? A decade? More? 
That was in Ferdiad, as I recall. Ooh, interesting. You were just a little pipsqueak. You really have grown up, haven't you? So they've known each other for a long time. I'm not sure it was quite that long ago. Not really. But it matters not. I remember those times well. Particularly your first words to me. Look at that young maiden wielding a giant lance. How adorable. <laughs> Dude, Demetrius' voice acting is top fucking tier. I love it. His delivery of lines. Oh, don't look at me like that. I was thrown so off good. by a haircut, that's all. It's all water under the bridge. Now, back then, I was quite furious about it. <laughs> My father did give me a stern reprimand for speaking so rudely to a prince. I am getting... I don't know, just in my head, I'm, I'm just getting these Yorichi and Biakia vibes here. <laughs> just remind, remind me of Yorichi poking fun of Biakia and him getting super pissed and chasing after her. But then, I never had a chance to apologize. I was always getting into trouble back then, just like the incident in Dusker. Speaking of, do you ever think about going back to House Karen? Do you, Cassandra? No. I'm happy with the life I have. Oh, here we go again with the Cassandra. No offense, your highness, but I don't fight for king and country anymore. I fight for Lady Rhea. Hmm. Oh. Okay. Okay. Was she initially, before she became the Knights of Seros, was she like a part of the king's like royal guard or something? I, th I think that's what that is. Doesn't fight for king and country anymore. Maybe after the, the regicide of uh, hit of Dimitri's father, she fled or left or something, changed her name, and then finally came back under a new identity. It doesn't bother you being labeled a criminal? Oh. You're worried about my life as a fugitive from the Holy Kingdom of Fargus. Don't worry about me. I'm here because I want to be. Criminal for what? It suits me far better than the life I'd otherwise lead as a noble lady of the kingdom. Is that so? How about you? You've never wanted to roam free? To enjoy life as an ordinary knight, unshackled from all those princely obligations. I can't say the thought has never crossed my mind. However, I am the son of a king. It's not possible for me to put my own desires before the good of the kingdom. Nah, you're too serious for your own good. How'd you become such a stiff? Don't worry, I've been working on that. Stretching is a part of my daily routine. <laughs> God, I love to be true. Joke about it. There's hope for you yet. God, these these supports are amazing. They're so good, guys. Like, what the fuck? Why is this so good? Like, I don't think I've had any one where I've just been like, eh, that's kind of uh, whatever. No, they're all like, oh my god, they're so fucking good. It's like such such good characterization too. Like, I'm just sitting here at the edge of my seat, like fucking hooked and fascinated, like linger on every one of their words, like just piecing this shit together and it's oh it's ah, ah, <laughs> so good fucking love it makes you so makes me so motivated to see more of it she is she's a priest why is she focused on well, it was faith that that's what it was it was faith not it was not reason right reason is not very high um she's good at riding good at flying she does have a hidden town for lances and she's good at swords interesting enough Wait a minute. Actually, physic is the... Did she not get physic? She got... Oh, no, this is something different. Physic physic is the one I was thinking of that does it from a distance. She got uh, recover, which... Does even Mercedes have that yet? No, she has restore. Recover is actually something different. Is it... Is it is, I think it said it was a stronger heal. So that's basically a yeah, light magic. He greatly heals an adjacent ally. Oh, interesting. Well, that's... Good, I guess. I mean, I guess if I need an extra heal, although I've, I've thought the regular here already give you a, a good amount. And that's a little bit of a bummer though, because I actually really just like having that range of the the, the physic one, like a lot. That thing is super good. But she does get physic. So what can a sword in faith give you? She can become a white knight, I think, right? I mean, she become a bishop, and then yeah, holy knight. No wait, that's a lance. Uh, sword, lance, and flying. Sword and Reason, that's a mortal savant, which is... Uh, there actually isn't anything for Sword and Faith. I don't know, then. <laughs> that's kind of a weird setup. So these characters have weird setups. Why Sword and Faith? Like, what am I supposed to do with that? 
And again, her strength is garbage. She only has high magic and her strength is seven. It's even worse than what Flames is. And Flames on a lower level too. That's weird. There's a lot of weird things in this, like for some of these characters. Oh, oh, hey. Oh, what? A magic attack. A empty increase based on units. Oh, wait a minute. I could give her the fucking sword that I gave to uh, freaking uh, Felix. It just hit me. There's something I can sort of do. Oh, it, yeah. Actually, in that instance, then that actually makes her really good because then it's making use of her magic stat and not her strength stat. So then that actually does give her a reason to use uh, to be good at swords. And she can actually use it too. Ooh. Potential. I smell potential. Now motivated. Might increase based on units resistance. Based on the resistance. Her resistance is very good. <laughs> Interesting. That is... Hmm. I just wish there was a class that actually did something with it though. I don't know, maybe there's a secret class at some point that'll, that will do something with it, but does not seem to be uh, anything apparent at this moment. God, Catherine is fucking stacked, though. Every time I recruit somebody, they always come with a bullion. You know something I'm actually kind of curious about? I'm going to try training her to be... Uh, get the Pegasus Knight. I'm just kind of curious to see if maybe that might raise her strength a bit, or like her base stats for some in some way. I don't actually plan to keep her there at the moment, but... Uh, nope, did not. All right. Today is a battle day. So we got the battle at Lake Two Two Tats or Two uh, Two Titties, Two Tatties. Uh, I think I think the yellow ones are like the DLC ones or something. And then we have these quest ones here. Practice battle maneuvers with the Knights of the Holy Kingdom of Farius. Banish up lately head of the village to stop them. Then we got the paralogs. So we got the forgotten. So he's unable to stand idly by. When he learns that the band of thieves wants to let Barris Brother McClellan are back to cause trouble. Uh, Ingrid, she's an unexpected proposal. It involves Dorothea. She seems to know something about it. And then short, the, the alliance has requested aid from the monastery. Knights of Ceres are low personnel. Uh, I think I want to do uh, the forgotten here. Sounds like... I think this might be what gets uh, Sylvanus spear back. I just have a feeling. Hey, Professor. How's life treating you? Are you working today? You gotta take a day sometime. Get out in the world and have some fun. And go uh, help me uh, kill some of uh, my brother's old friends. That's not, that's a mad bad idea. I could never. It's not a bad idea. <laughs> right? Sometimes you gotta forget all the things you ought to do and focus on what you'd rather do. Hey, we should go get something to eat. My treat. So he's trying to butter me up for he has me do it. <laughs> no, thank you. What are you after? What? I can't invite my professor to dinner without it being a scam? <laughs> uh, uh, okay, fine. You got me. I got you, bitch. I need to ask a favor, and I wanted a way to work up the courage to ask you. <laughs> ask me what? It's about a girl. No, for once, it's not about a girl. Well, actually, there is a thing about a girl, but I'll tell you about that later. There are thieves in my family's territory. I was wondering if you'd go with me to drive them off. You remember the thief leader you fought at Conan Tower, yeah? Your brother? Yes, Miklon. He was the oldest son of House Gautier. What's left of his band of thieves is causing trouble in Gautier territory. My father has asked me to come home and put down those murderous jerks. But he's asked for me to come alone. No knights, no backup of any sort. That's crazy, right? Yes, that's crazy. Why just you? Because he thinks he'd lose face asking the church for help. I don't know. He could have asked another trusted house to send troops, but he only asked me. I'm sorry. You expect his son to come there alone and fight an entire arm army alone? And the way my father is, he probably has some other motive that I'll never know. Maybe he just wants me to get some more experience in battle. A crazy way to suggest it, though. Anyway, I'm not going alone, no matter what he asks. I'm going to ask some of the others in our class to help, too. But none of us have your experience. If you'd come with us, I'd be grateful. Yeah, man, I got you. Great. I'll talk to the others and see who's in. Thanks, Professor. Let's go murder the rest of these assholes. Maybe get you that fucking lance back. Hopefully nobody picked it up when they went to 
Go attack your uh, your home. This place seems kind of cold. <laughs> God damn it, not again. All right. How are we looking here? Thieves. There's quite a few of them here. Oh, there's a thief leader. He's got Banshee. In intermediate dark magic. Foe hit foes hit suffer reduced uh, movement for one turn. Yikes. And of course, he's staying on a freaking healing tile. Raises avoidance, defense, resistance for non-flyers. Uh, oh wait, are we starting on? Oh, we we're 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 doing a pincer attack. We got people on this side and people on the other side. That's interesting. And we also have people on over here too. So wait, you guys are starting literally right next to the to the leaders? <laughs> Seriously? Oh no, we have we have we have someone on our side too though. Right, one right there. Uh, and one over here. I'm gonna bet my my goal will be to, to kill the leaders probably. Uh, ooh, I get 11 this time. All right. Uh, okay, so we got 11 people. Um, uh, for myself, uh, not Cyril. I don't want Raphael. I'll stick uh, Cyril with uh, Shamir here. And they get experience, I believe, right? Even if they're not in the fight, I think. Or is it just affinity? Uh, interesting. I actually choose not to bring Dimitri here, but... And I think I actually will do that this time because um, he's already so... He's such a high level. Um, should I bring other people in? I think I'm bringing Marianne in. Give her a try. And Catherine. All right. Now oh, I gotta kill everybody. Okay. Not just the leaders. Okay. We've got the thieves covered on both sides. I still have a time loot this time. Some of the thieves are still carrying what they stole. So we have a chance to get it back. Gotta be careful though. They'll run off faster than a nobleman's daughter if we just rush in. Target the strongholds to cut off their escape routes. Oh. So I just get in front of it so they can't go out that way. Are they not attacking yet? They I seem to be in aggro range. Do they just not see me somehow? <laughs> Do they appear to be looking right at me? No, they definitely see me. How the fuck am I supposed to get over there though before they, they can just walk out there? Bonk. Get him, Bernie. Boom, boom. My father is offering a reward for every thief and rogue we take out. The more you beat, the more you get. Just remember, ah. you gotta take them down fast. They'll bolt as soon as they're hurt. Take the strongholds and we cut off their escape route. Oh, I see. The moment they're hurt. All right. Defeat the thieves where they retreat. Get rewards based on how many you defeat. Bonk. Bonk. The fight continues. That's what Ash. I'm not sticking around here to get slaughtered by a bunch of stuck up jerks like you. Oh, well, you're going to be dead here in a second, so, you know. Boom. Boom. To work. To work. Finish him. Ah. Uh, dead. Nice one, Shamir. This will make the job easier. Yep. Zero levels up, too. Okay, that'll do it. This exit route is blocked off. Very good. Now let's keep cool and take out the other strongholds. Oh, I see. Okay. So, um, once I kill that guy, then the, their, uh, yeah, once I kill their leader, I guess, then that route is, is blocked off. Yeah. Eat that. Oh. Nope. You ain't got shit on it there. Just the power of poison. Eat this bitch, boom. Fuck it, missed. Are you kidding me? It had a 70 fucking 5% chance of doing it. No, fuck you. Seriously? God damn it. It's time. It's time. Oh, well, mine better fucking hit. I got a 90% chance. Boom. Bonk. Wonk. Last one, Sylvain. This is what a real man looks like. This is what a real man looks like, boy. Okay, let's try Are this ready? again. Is this okay? 80% chance now. Boom. Ah, holy shit. 
Casper with the training gauntlets. Wreck him. Bonk. 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 What a jump. All right, here we go. Ha ha. Eat poison. Ow. Careful, Marianne. Oh, fuck. Oh, thank God. I'm really sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. Uh oh. Please don't go after Marianne. Please don't. No. Oh, no. Fuck. Well, that was a mistake. I'm sorry. I wasn't able to help. I'm sorry, Marianne. We'll go back. Eat this bitch. Boom. Hey, look at that. I won. Oh, it's the sword from uh uh that uh that one character from Smash Brother has has, I think. Robin? Yeah. Ah. Ah. Fucking so Seriously? Wow, and then she dies in two hits. Uh fuck. Alright, Marianne Marianne, I think you're just gonna have to not be there. You're just taking so much damage. You only have, you do only have five defense, which is not great. Boom. Should I have held back? Boom. Die, dummy. No hard feelings. Now I feel demon powerful. I feel more. Oh, so obvious. So obvious. So is it a slow? Ow. Oh god. Ow. Watch out for those fists, guys. Damn, nice one, Shamir. Silence. Get wrecked. Holy shit. Boom. Oh, what shot one kill. And sort of level up again. Feel like I grew up a little. Holy shit. There you go. <laughs> that guy's making a break for it. He's like, nope, done. Never mind. Bitch, you're going nowhere. Yo. Yeah. Nice. Everyone will be so pleased. Everyone will be so pleased. All right. Kill him. <laughs> Seems I prevailed. That's what Ingrid. Pegasus. Pegasus. Taking aim. Oh my God, Shamir, really? Bah! <laughs> <laughs> oh, dead. <laughs> oh my God. One shot, one dead. I'll grow as strong as I can. Jesus, Shamir. Ling waste to everybody. Try to say something for the rest of us. Boom. That's how it goes. That's how it's done. Is this a joke? Jesus, Ash, what in the fuck, man? I've been getting some bad rolls with fucking Ash whenever he levels up. Like, really bad. That's happened to him a lot. Man, sucks. All right, Catherine. Boom. Boom. I'll never back down. His power of armor slayer. Ah! Mine. Holy shit. Another step forward. All right. That's yep. One more stronghold taken, and one more escape route blocked. There are still some strongholds left. Professor. What should we go for first? Oh, no, no. Let's win this already. You gotta be fucking kidding me. 75% chance and he keeps fucking missing? Fucking gotta be kidding. You're out of luck. Boom. 
Bad idea. Boom. <laughs> Don't you realize I'm a... This Daisy Princess is a fucking beast? That guy's going for a run, run for it, even though the gate's closed. So you got nowhere to go, boy. He's like, oh, shit. Fuck, I am screwed. Bonk. I won, naturally. Guess I've gotten better. Jeez. So they on the other hand, has been getting amazing stat boosts. My guy's just gonna go the fuck in. Everybody, come at me. Or run away from me. Fear my mind. Oh, yep, you made a mistake. Bye bye. Big Chunga Wonga. Ah, oh, me missed. Ah. As expected. Brah, brah. Oh, damn it, she missed. Him with Thunderbrand. Please. Please. Oh, my God. Oh, okay, great. There you go. All you needed was one. Jesus. I was about to say Catherine. I know it didn't have much of a chance of hitting him, but it was a coin flip. Another escape route blocked. Take out those thieves and capture that last stronghold. All right. Put me in there. Bonk. Yeah, it worked. Yeah, the train gauntlets are like the best fucking gauntlets, honestly. Stronger than ah, damn it, Casper. Boom. Boom. Silenced. Silenced. Guess you're saying it's fucking healing spot. Yeah, they're all making a break for it. Just gotta get rid of that last stronghold. Ow. Eat this, motherfucker. Taste the power of a net. Boom. That the last stronghold is gone. Nice one. Feeling stronger. All right. Everybody locked in here now. Nobody going anywhere. The fight continues. Ooh, Speedwing. Get him, Bernie. Yeah. Anywhere I can hide. <laughs> Anywhere I can hide. Please. No, Bernie, you're doing a good job. You're doing a good job. Murder and pillage it. With the arrow's rain. Please hit. Yes. Yeah, I'm doing it. <laughs> I'm doing it. I'm really doing it, guys. Eat this bitch. <laughs> Boom. You're out of luck. Boom. Level up. I feel. Got your back. Bye bye, bitch. Our strategy is solid. Brah. I did what I had to. Fly, birdies, fly. Goddess ring. A ring endowed with the goddess's divine protection restores HP each turn. Ooh, that's got uh, potential. Bonk. Can I go now? Oh, not yet, Bernie. There you go. I guess hard work. Ooh, a short spear. Yeah. Boom. Right makes might, right? All right, good one, Casper. Ooh. Marion is very squishy, like very, very, very squishy. Way squishier than like Mercedes got like eleven defense. She only got five. Look, look at this. Like this guy will come over. He can kill. He'll just kill her in a single hit. It's like man, fuck. That one is expected. 
Fortunately, he's not going to be doing that today. <laughs> These guys aren't even attacking me. They're just running. You ain't going nowhere, motherfuckers. Can't afford to lose. And seal. You Boom. Well, 15. Guess I've gotten better. So we're moving on up. Uh, magic staff. A staff that guides the use of magic and raises might for magical attacks. Oh, neat. Or else there were like magic staffs in this game. Is that, is, is, so it's actually a weapon, right? So just, uh, yeah, I guess it would be used by like uh, Annette or something, right? Or anyone who's a wizard. Cool. It's kind of surprised they don't sell that like in the shop. It's like a pretty basic thing. Really? Ah. I'm not at my best. I was thinking this is a, a short spear is actually a ranged lance. So like what, uh, uh, Ingrid has like the javelin. Nice. That'll be like an upgrade, I think, to what she already has. Ah. Ah. Yeah. Oh. Boom! Burning with the killing blow. Energy drop. That's the last of them. Great work, everyone. Way to slaughter them all. Leaves everywhere. I can't believe this is what the world is coming to. At least we've restored the peace here, even if it's only for a little while. Peace has been restored. You defeat all the thieves. Extra large bullion. Holy shit. Fuck yeah. Gold bullion sells from extremely high price at shops. Like 10,000 or something? Because the, the bullion is 1,000. The large bullion was 5,000. So I think maybe this one will be like 10,000 or something. A longbow. Uh, a bow with plus one range. Nice. Get a lot of good shit. Talisman. Pearling increased resistance by two. Woohoo! All right. Good. MVP was fucking Shamir. Damn right. She killed so many guys in just like one shot. She's a beast. So we can play the paralogue and earn a battalion. The uh, the Gautier Knights. Nice. Oh, it looks like he didn't get his spear back though. Okay, I guess I wasn't this after all. That's okay. We did pretty damn well as it is. Professor, thank you for your help. We drove off the thieves and got a reward from my father. Job well done, eh? Although, I don't know how to feel about this particular reward. I guess oh, that's no, he did. My father tasked me with this mission. He wanted me to prove myself worthy of this relic. There we go. This weapon, the Lance of Ruin, it killed my brother. And now it's mine. Isn't that dangerous? <laughs> Been not turned to a not demon on me, Sylvain. I bear the crest of Gautier. The same crest my brother wished for his whole life, but never came to possess. You're still thinking about your brother, aren't you? I suppose I am. Miklon hated me from the moment he found out I had a crest and he didn't. He was selfish and egotistical. I know it's not right to say bad things about the dead, but he earned it. Even now, I'm still cleaning up his messes. I have to wonder though, what if it was the other way around? If he had the crest, and I didn't, would I be the one my father thought was worth forgetting? Or would my fate have been wholly unlike his? Thinking like that won't get you anywhere, man. You're probably right, Professor. It's not like me, is it? I don't pray much. So I go back to chase and tail. I think I'm going to pray for those who lost their lives to the thieves tonight. And for all of us. I'm afraid there are more days like these coming our way. How do you say that? Vargas has always been a cold place, never very well to do. Until about 10 years ago, our region was a battlefield for the people of the Srang region to the north. And after the late king fell, the whole kingdom became unstable. So it's no real surprise that more and more people are resorting to thievery just to survive. And there are those rumors of the current region being too busy chasing the ladies to bother with governing. Don't worry, I get the irony. Yeah. The whole damn kingdom is in decline because of nonsense like that. I'm hoping once we get Dimitri on the throne, everything will get better. Anyway, I'll leave it up to you to decide how you want to use our reward. Including the Lance of Ruin. I know I can trust you with it until you think I'm ready. And Professor, if I could, I'd still like to buy you a meal sometime. Dude, I think you are already ready, man. Yeah, you're still chasing the skirts, but... God damn, man. When we really get to know you, you're actually... I mean, he's a smart guy. He sees the world for as it is in a lot of ways. 
for better or worse. There's no need. <laughs> you have another favor to ask? <laughs> There's no need. Hey, come on. Aren't we friends now? No, I'm a teacher. Again, though? Thank you for everything, Professor. I couldn't have done it alone. Aw. That was sweet. And we got the Lance of Ruin. Wait, what? The mine on this thing is 22? What the fuck? Mine on mine is only seven. This is 22? Excuse me? Is that right? That doesn't seem right. That can't be right. That seems, that'd be busted. I don't know. I'm, I'm a little, I'm skeptical of that. <laughs> mine's seven. 22. There's no way. Right? What the fuck? This thing has 22 might? 20 critical, 65 ch hit, hit per chance, that's not very good. Its weight is only nine though. Holy crap. By the way, you guys, so you guys explain to me. So because he bears the crest of the Gautier, right? He can obviously use this full potential. Apparently other people who have crest can also use the, the spear normally. Um, but it's only people with the crest that, the, the specific crest that they can use their abilities. Those who don't have any crest will actually take damage if they try to use uh, any of these uh, uh, relics, these heroes relics. I see. Wow. Okay. What? How? That seems that seems insanely broken. Seriously. I don't think I've even hit anything in a weapon that goes to the double digits yet until this. I mean, it's got 20 durability, but I think so does mine. Yeah. That's mine's mine is seven. It's fucking seven. And his is 22. I mean, 65 hit chance. Maybe that's the point. It's like it's a, um, almost a coin flip. I don't know. I mean, I think some of that depends on your own stats too, though, right? Or can it just not go any higher than 65? Either way, fuck. Some crazy banana shit right there. Yeah, so the javelin's a little heavier, but it's got a bit higher attack. And probably increased strength by two. Energy drop. Oh, Cyril got his uh, support Shamir there. All right, I, think I, should, I think Ash should be the one to get the uh, the boost to uh, his strength. Speedwing gets speed butt by two. There's the the speed. I'm gonna give it to Casper. There we are. There we go. God, Casper's resistance is terrible, too. Oh my god, Raphael has literally no resistance. Wow. Holy shit. I'm gonna give it to the high resistance one to him, though, to, to do. Just so, because he is my tank. My physical tank. So make him at least more of a, a magic tank as well. All right, let's do uh, Ingrid's now. Rumored nuptials. What's the matter, Ingrid? I never hear you sigh like that. Oh, hi, Dorothea. And hello, Professor. Nothing's the matter. Well, nothing major. You don't look like it's nothing major. <laughs> then again, I suppose you always have a furrowed brow, don't you? Truth be told, there's rather a lot going on. It seems that there's always something to worry about. Uh, what do you worry about? Uh, what's worrying you right now? Now? Oh, I, I really did not wish to bother you with such trivialities. <laughs> Come on, Ingrid, you know how to pick the option. I would do with it. You see, I received a letter from my father recently. From Count Galatea? What a kind gentleman to have for a father. I thank you. But the content within the letter is what I find troubling. Let me see. Oh, it's a marriage proposal. For you. Have you met the Suda? I've not met him, though I've heard his name here and there. He began life as a merchant, but has somehow achieved rank in court. An enterprising noble from an allied territory. It's most likely that he wants the crest of Daphnol that I bear to adorn his family name. Hmm, yes, that sounds about right. The jerk. You sound as though you know him, do you? Yes, I must admit that I know him. He tried to court me when I was a singer. Best advice I can give you, Ingrid? Stay far, far away from this guy. Or kill him, one or the other. He's offered a sizable dowry, so I must at least consider it. For the sake of my family. Dowry? <laughs> Blood money. That's all it is. Blood money. Dorothea, I... This jerk's entire fortune is soaked in blood. Do you want to rebuild your own house using that kind of money? 
I mean, it's all just rumors, but I think it still might be worth investigating. What do you think, Professor? Should we go check this guy out? Yes, Dorothy, I wish you could put a hit on this guy and go kill him. Yeah, you got it. Let's go. Great. Let's tell the others. All I know is that somebody's gonna die. <laughs> There's a fight here and somebody's about to demon die today. Really? Okay. Go on, Ingrid. You get first blood. <laughs> and we're already fighting. Why? I don't know. Where? What the fuck are we? Uh, what? So we're gonna go check this. We're gonna go investigate your your suitor to be. He's inside an active volcano. <laughs> Seriously, where the fuck are we? Oh God, we're seeing shit that causes damage each turn. Uh, rogue. Is he the only guy here? He's the only guy here. I'm sure there's nobody else here that's gonna pop out of fucking nowhere. <laughs> that is kind of funny. Like it's just one lone dude. Do, 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 do. Is that your husband to be? Just hanging out over here, chilling out, doing his thing. Um, there's a chest just hanging out right here. One more reason why I gotta have Ash with me. This is a bizarre. I, like, what are we doing here? And Dorothea's with us. So she's a, a mage. What are her abilities? Songstress. Jason tiles recover up to 10% of max HP at the start of each turn. Wow, that's pretty good, actually. And she casts fire. Well, lot your fire, boy. This, Dorothy, you are constantly at the chart, the top of most deployed units, so you must be really good. That or just a top tier Wafu, or both. Okay, we only have nine in this this fight. All right, I think we'll stick Flane uh, as an adjunct with Sylvain. Uh, we have Casper in there, Catherine, Ash, Mercedes, Bernadette, and the rest. Earl's doing pretty well in levels. Well, Cyril. But never, I, I actually didn't change his... Well, I, I couldn't, actually. I can't change his class yet. Um, yeah, let's just go with... Uh, with Flane right now. All right, let's give it a go. Root the en enemy or get Ingrid to the target destination. Uh, oh, God. The more we look into this guy, the more I see he's a monster and no good for my Ingrid. No kidding. There's no denying it. We better get back to the monastery. <laughs> Hold on a minute, you brats. <laughs> what? <laughs> I can't hear you from all the way over here. Oh, there they are. Hand over the girl. Surely you can't mean me. Wait, did he send them? This jerk figures he can grab Ingrid before things get too messy for him. Of course, we know the truth about him now, and he'll want to kill us and get rid of the evidence. Where do we go, anyway? Seriously, though. Well, we do it inside a volcano. But we'll never let him take Ingrid. Come on, let's hurry. Guys, nobody gonna answer me? No? All right, fine, whatever. Protect Ingrid. Don't let anyone get near her. Nobody touch my Ingrid. Nobody. <laughs> You'll never escape. Never. Damn, that's what we get for taking that detour to go see the Gorons. When Ingrid reaches their destination, we'll win the battle. Protect Ingrid from those dastardly rogues. Okay, over there. All the way over there. Okay, fly. Okay. Actually, good news is that you're not going to be affected by any of the uh, the painful burning stuff. Holy shit, the Lance of Ruin kicks fucking ass. Damn. Ruin Sky. Oh, I didn't actually see what his move was, like what that move did. Effective against flyers and dragons. Damn. Strong. Killer Axe. Deadly Sharp Axe that boasts a high criti critical rate. Wow, 11 might. That's nice. Hold on to that. Uh, okay, yeah, kill him, Dorothea. Boom, boom. I've got many skills, you know. All right, she can't level up though. Fuck. Boom. That is that. Chop maggot. Boom. Fish and burning. Yeah. Boom. <laughs> I got him! All right, Ingrid. All right, we're going to split up and just... Yeah, get Ingrid to the end. Or just kill everybody that gets in your way. <laughs> you missed. I'll increase the reward. Now hurry up and capture that girl. 
That merchant is giving orders to the bandits. I bet if we take him out, reinforcements will cease. Ah, okay. Oh god, reinforcements. All right. Oh, so we actually have terrain here that's actually hard for horses to travel again across. Yep. Have a taste of the soul of the creator, motherfucker. Whoosh. Oh. Ah. Finally get a chance to use that. this thing. Boom. Prayer ring. Ring be with the pet prayer of a saint. Source HP each turn. Eat. Yeah! <laughs> Hitting with my axe worked! <laughs> I can do so much better. Okay. Catherine, take this dickhead out. Oops, use Thunderbrand. Ah. Whoopsies. Oh well. Can't hold me back. I owe you one. Level up! I won't let everyone down. Alright. Good Mercedes. Sorry, right, step on the hot lava. It tastes my lava. While you're at it. Boom. And boom. No hard feelings. Brah. I did what I had to. Oh, you missed. Oh my gosh, you can fly over that fucking lava. Kick ass. Oh, bitch, get ready to eat it. <laughs> That's so awesome. Boom. And you're dead. Well, uh, that's the end of that. A reinforcement for you. I'll take that antitoxin. You want to capture me, bitch? Come and get me. I'm right fucking here. Yoink. Gah. For Lady Rhea. Oh, for Lady Rhea! A holy green hairedness! Just let me at her. <laughs> what you want? Gosh, she's pretty diesel. She's fucking killing everybody in a single hit. Yeah! Yeah! I must steal myself. All right, Ash. See if we can get you a good fucking level up. There we go. I'm starting to see results. It's a bit better. Devil Axe. Uh, oh my god, Might 18. Double Biological Axe that inflicts 10 damage after combat. Jesus. 10 damage to the user, I guess? 60% hit chance. 14, 14 weight, but it is strong as shit. 10 damage, that is quite a bit though. Might be something you give to like, to do or something. Someone who's got a lot of, a lot of health and a lot of defense and a lot of shit. Ah, ah. Each battle a chance to grow. Boom. Boom. Oh god. Try right, slay them all, Ingrid. Yeah. Yeah. Holy shit. Ow. Did he poison him? Is he staying on a poison area or something? No idea. Who's next? Dead? <laughs> Boom. I'll never back down. No one makes it past me. Alright. I thought I was dead. I thought it was fudge. Booyah. I will get stronger. Okay. So, so stat boost. Miss. Ah, damn it. Let's do this. Ah, fuck. Watch out, Casper. Please dodge. 70% chance. That's uh, not a good chance. 
The odds were not in your favor there. Ow, he's still poisoned. Still gonna fucking die. Thanks for helping. There we are. Really? That one is Dead. expected. Uh oh. In hiding here, they are really getting on my last nerve. The fuck? Where did they come from? Stick to oh, whatever. Uh, go ahead, everyone, come at me. Maybe I have a chance of my level 18 ass. Jesus Christ! We must all do our part. You'll need me for this. I have an idea. Eat this. Boom. Burn. Okay. What the hell? I thought I got rid of the reinforcements. Holy! Oh my God! I was sick looking. She just dodged it and blasted him with fire. That was awesome. Oh come on! Okay, thirty percent chance. It better fucking miss. Thank you. Oh, you missed me too. What about you? God damn it, me. Hi guys. But you missed. Boom, 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 boom. Who's next? Here we go. Woo, woo. Yeah. <laughs> yes. All right. Next up. Whoop. Ba doop, ba doop. Wubba lubba dub dub. Wubba lubba dead dead. I gotta get over to him. Try to heal his uh, stats effect. There we go. Do so much better. All right. Good step boost. Guess this gambit and Chris Liberty's movement is fucking useful as hell. Thanks, Bernie. Much appreciated. Excuse me. Please get out of my way. Should I have held back? Probably. Seriously? Okay, I'm, I'm starting to think they don't end, maybe, the enemies here. Ow. Bonk. Each battle a chance to grow. Just killing them all myself. Don't mind me. Yep. You fought well. Heal the poison. There we go. Casper's Kingdom Infantry withdrew. What the fuck? Healing staff. Staff that increases the effect of magic healing. Nice. I think I know where that's going on. That is that. Boom. Right makes money, right? It's the power of the lance of ruin. Oh! Dead. Be gone. Be gone, that thing is beastly. I'm really getting the hang of this. Is Flane really not leveled up yet? Is that being part of his thing and he's kicking ass? No. Oh, Ernie leveled up. Whoa, did I get stronger? Heck yeah, girl. <laughs> Boom. <laughs> Boom. Dead. Got him. All right, we did it. <laughs> no, there was definitely an end to them. And that was it. I'm the MVP because I killed like 30 dudes. Most of them were just killing themselves by running into me like running into a brick wall. Thanks to the efforts of Bisley and all of your allies' motivations increased. Hey! Oh, that's cool. That's interesting. So if I end up being the MVP, everyone's motivation increased. Well, shit, I feel like I should be the MVP <laughs> every time that... A renown increase, too. All right. Learn, earn the Galatea Pegasus Co. All right. I'll be uh, perfect for uh, for Ingrid, assuming she has enough authority to equip it. 
Now, let's get out of here before Bernie uh, burns <laughs> on the lava she's currently standing on. Ingrid, welcome back. Did you speak with your father? I did. I just returned to the monastery. What happened the proposal? As soon as I informed him of the suitor's unsavory tendencies, he rejected the proposal outright. Were we to form ties with such an individual, it would bode poorly for our family, regardless of the weighty dowry offered. Oh, thank goodness. I'm so glad it all worked out. You and me both. My father also insisted I take this. <gasps> oh! What the fuck? I did not ex- Oh, so we do. We just- We're gonna be getting heroes box through all these fucking paralogs, aren't we? Or a lot of them. Holy shit. I thought that- I thought all the heroes rocks would be like main story stuff. A heroes relic. Oh shit. Indeed. This is the Magic Lance Luin. Which has been passed down for generations within my family. Oh, fuck yeah. Now Ingrid's got her own freaking hero's relic. Oh man, I should be kicking ass too. What how powerful it is. My father and siblings have no way of using it since they bear no crest. Father told me I should take it and use it to protect <laughs> it's basically just a there. fucking ornament at home. <laughs> it's better used protecting his daughter than gathering dust. All right. Oh, that's so sweet. Why didn't you give it to her before she father left? really does mean well, Ingrid. He's unendingly stubborn, but I am proud of who he is. Dorothea, Professor, I want to thank you. Of course. So it was important that we help you. It really was quite exciting, too. So, you know, don't worry about it. I could never hand over my lovely Ingrid to some jerk who only wants her for her crest. <laughs> I'm pretty sure Dorothea might want Ingrid for herself. Oh. Do I belong to you now, rather than to myself? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> that wasn't a no. <laughs> All right, Luin. Uh, not as strong as the Lance of Ruin. Well, not in terms of might. It has a better hit chance though. Seventeen might, nine weight, ten crit. Fuck yeah. Cool. All right. My Thank you so much. I, I thank you so much. I know, I know. Dorothea, you are, you've are you been at the top since the beginning of this Let's Play. No one has been able to topple you. Oh, I see. Everyone's everyone's motivation will go up by just one, though, when I, when I become MVP. Just one motivation, so not a ton. All right, well, we did a pretty good job, though. At least managing to balance people's levels out a bit more. Flea didn't actually go up at all, though, did she? By being part of uh, being hooked up with Sylvain, I, did he not really? I guess he didn't really maybe get that many kills. Let's do Flane and Dimitri for, for Tass. Uh, all right, to do. So maybe get you up on your axe there. Yeah. Answered correctly. Damn right you did. No need for praise. Good boy. I have. D Come on, man, give me the perfect. Oh, so close. That's all right. I'll probably level up at the end of the week. All right, Mercedes. Your reason up. Yes. Yeah. There we go. <laughs> All right, once more. Come on, baby. Oh, you just, ah, so close. Ingrid, you must up with their flight. I appreciate. Come on, come on, Ingrid. Uh, Bernie, get up your bow. You got it, Bernie. I got it. Good girl. <laughs> have a have a cookie. Thanks for the help. There we go. B rank, baby. I'd never have learned this back in my room. Uh uh. -oh. I got it. And your horsey stuff. All right, Felix. Chipping uh chipping axes, cause we're gonna need it. This could be. Cool. And Ash, let's go ahead and get you up. Uh, up a bit more in authority. I've learned. This will so we can't get you this better gambits or seas. All right, begin lecture, professor. Uh, you know, jousting is a popular sport in Fargus. Ladies love a guy who can joust. Speaking of, let's pause for riding and land skills. What do you know? The thing I already have you on. Sure, civilian's goals have stayed the exact same. We got Chris know about how Dorothy is doing. Okay, I guess I must have bought her with her in the last uh last fight. Well, I had fun today. Of course, 
You want to see me again, yes? Uh, of course. I'd love to, Dorothea. Oh, damn, she is a flirt, isn't she? <laughs> well, until we meet again. Mm hmm, yeah. Like the female oh. Sylvain. Hello, Professor. Were you watching that? That's a different guy than I saw you with yesterday. Yes. Is there a problem with that? Look, I know what I'm doing. My claim as a diva won't last forever, after all. I must look to the future. Gotta fuck everybody and everything! As a man, you may not feel so rushed about these things, but I know my beauty will eventually fade. We all feel excited about aging. Getting older doesn't bother me at all. <laughs> it's not for me. We all feel excited about aging. You? Really? I never would have guessed. Unless I'm like a thousand year old demon myself. Anyway, I'm not just playing games with these boys. This is for my future. You have no right to object. Bit to fuck so many of them? I very much want to find a good partner here at the Academy. Someone who will take care of me for the rest of my life. Do what you will. Is that really what you want? Finding someone to take care of me? <laughs> of course it is. Who could ask for anything more? Anyway, I value your opinion, Professor, but I won't have you interfering with my life plans. Unless you'd like to take care of me into my old age. That'd be something, eh? How about it, Professor? <laughs> okay. <laughs> I wasn't... You aren't being serious, are you? I was just teasing. <laughs> okay. <laughs> sure, why not? I'm just not an ending girl anyway. Dorothea, hop aboard. Or did you really just consider spending your whole life with me? Sure, I mean, we're at a C rank. What, what, what do you think? If you did, that that actually makes me... It makes me happy. I had no idea you might look at me that way. Girl, you've been flirting with me to hell and back, all right? And you were all kinds of cute. You really didn't see this coming. You've gotten awfully quiet. You might even be blushing a bit. Have I embarrassed you? If so, I'm very, very sorry. I should be going anyway. I'll see you later, Professor. Hmm, that was a rather unusual encounter, wasn't it? Well, I'm not really planning to go further with Dorothea. That was kind of just a, a side effect, really. So, uh, Ash, all right, let's have a tea party, Ash. Hopefully I don't fuck this up. Uh, do I have your... Fucking tea. Do I want to look it up? Uh, I might actually. Mint leaves. I think mint tea is what he's, his favorite is. I've had this kind of before. Yep. It's quite good. Woo! -hoo! Thank you very much. Would you like a cinnamon roll, Ash? <laughs> I love. We have a whole bunch of pastries here. Ah, still too hot. This one literally has your face on it. Huh? Uh, heart racing memories. Your ambitions. Being the perfect knight. Being the perfect knight, of course. Yeah, you like your knight stories. Uh, dining partners, plans for the futures, equipment upkeep. Uh, plans for the future? Yes. Yes. Uh, you seem well. Perfect recipes, fashion, perfect recipes. Fuck yeah, baby! I know my cinnamon bun. I'm confident at my speed. No one can outrun me. Commend, admonish, si sip tea, yes. commend. Woo! <laughs> yeah. Best boy, it's time to meet you. All right, here we go. Time for me to look upon your cinnamon freckles. I've been trying to build more muscle lately. I need to be stronger to keep up with everything. Oh yeah. <laughs> what do you think of my guns, Professor? <laughs> oh, it hurts to flex. <laughs> Woo! What is it? <laughs> I just can't stop staring at your little at your little freckles. They're so cute. I'm gonna tickle you. I've been trying to build more muscle. Oh yeah, muscle. This game's so weird. <laughs> I love it. Uh, all right. Uh, I think we're good, man. Thanks for the tea. I hope we can do this again. Happy birthday, Ash. Our charm is increased. <laughs>
Oh, something going on? I am ready to begin. Oh, yes. <laughs> you are not a fish. I do not wish to eat you then. Oh, thank God. No problem at all. It is done. Ah, damn it. That's it, guys. Come on, you two. All right, B+. Plus. First person to reach B+, plus to do. With access. Oh, my God. We got a lot of level ups. It seems I've improved. Axe prowess. I've got it. Helm splitter. It all makes sense now. Alert stance. Let's put this to the test. Bombard and brawling prowess. Nice. All right. We've got just Cyril and uh, Shamir here. But I think that's something we're going to have to save for next time, guys. Uh, anyway, I hope you all enjoy this episode. If you did, please leave a like and a favorite. And subscribe if you're already become Piggy Penguin. For this will be where the days are always sunny and the vids are always funny. But anyway, guys, as always, till next time, stay classy.